pregnant, and I don't know who the father is. We can resolve the issue using a non-invasive paternity test. I can't do that right now. Why not? Because if we find out that Mark's the father, it could change how I feel about our baby. I was on pins and needles to find out how Jack and Mel were going to deal with the uh, pregnancy. That's a cliffhanger. That was a cliffhanger. Was a cliffhanger. I, I was really interested to see how Jack was going to react to the fact that it may or may not be his child. But I was pleasantly surprised with his upbeat attitude <laughs> toward the whole thing. <laughs> I, I can't, I'm not a patient person. So when I had my own children, I immediately found out what the sex was of both of my babies as soon as humanly possible. So if I had been faced with any kind of paternity question, I mean, I can't imagine just having that be something massively unanswered in my life. I, I, I feel like Mark and Jack look very different. So I feel like at some point you'd kind of figure it out. One's going to have long flowing <laughs> hair, right? And you'll know just by yeah. the hair alone. It'll be the dimples. Yeah, the dimples. The dimples. The charm. It'll be char come, come, the charm coming right out of the room. Weird. Yeah, I think, look, I, I agree with Alex. I don't know if my curiosity could stand not knowing, but I think it was an, a really interesting take that the writers chose where they gave Jack this perspective of, okay, I'm going to be the father to this woman I love's child, but it may not be my own. And I think, like Jack says, and halfway through the season, you know, one would assume you would have the same relationship to that child. You know, there there is sort of a, a selfishness to people too, and this idea that, well, if it's not mine, will I, will I have the same degree of connection to this child? And we know from people who have you know, adopted kids which you know creates the conflict between Jack and Mal in terms of their desire to know the and stuff that actually you can love a child just as much and and actually biology doesn't really isn't the defining factor of love however i think it was interesting that Jack as a man who doesn't know that from experience has doubts so it was you know it was an interesting sort of ride that they then go along and trying to navigate that and be respectful to one another's you know individual take on it and then all, all the drama that ensues from it but yeah i think i would want to know <laughs> straight away I, I really wish we got to shoot the scenes where jack you actually see jack react to the news because you know i mean that's that's an interesting day where the woman you're with tells you that she's carrying a child that might be another dude like i mean just to see a man deal with that would have been really fascinating to play but i'm sure he would have quickly understood Mel's reason, and he was part of the reason for her decision. But anyway, we don't need to unpack that too much.